Good morning, gentlemen. Now, um, this is um, Prophecy of Pendor, and for all, and if you've if you've gone into my back catalogue of YouTube videos, you'll notice that I have at many points tried to start uh, various let's plays of this. Um, however, with the announcement of version 4.0, which I'd imagine would be coming soonish, I decided to make another attempt. And usually, and, you, and usually the stars align and I do this and I get bored or I have technical issues or I just fail. But this time will be, this time will be different. So, <laughs> he looks like, he looks a bit like ob Obelisk <laughs> from, um, from the Asterix and Obelisk comics. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, this, I would, I would say, I would say, I would, I would say that this is a really, really fun mod, although, Although it is, it is quite um, it is quite it is quite un unforgiving. Um. Now, <laughs> I'm gonna start in the. Where the hell am I going to start? Uh. Yeah, I'm going to start in the in the Empire because I usually start in Ravenstone, and I know I know Ravenstone's advantages in battle like the back of my hand, and it's quite frankly it is boring. Anyway, run, run, running through the standard tutorial here. Um, Oh well. Oh dear. Well, that happened. Hmm. <laughs> so I I had I had actually I had a, I had actually I had actually thought about skipping this tutorial because because through because in terms of because in terms of mountain blade mods the opening tutorials are more more or less the same they more or less follow they more or less follow a, a very a very simple um a very simple um um They more or less follow a very samey template, so they're all more or less rescue such and such relative from bandits, um, and it's always terribly boring. No. Oh, three hundred and seventy-one. That's cheap. Um, six south hordes now. These guys aren't the best, but I'm at the moment I'm just looking to overwhelm uh, the enemy at this point. So go to Gonmar, see if I can see if I can pester any peasants into joining me for meat shields too. Okay then, that's that's somewhat. It's not as many as I'd hoped, but it's a fair amount. So go back to the tavern, merchant person. I have men. Now you you may have not you may have you may you may you may have noticed that um. You may you may you may have noticed that in this 
that in that in previous attempts at Pendor, um, I have I have I have actually failed um, when it came to when it when it came to um, when it came to defending myself against snake cultists, um, and that and that's for one simple reason: those um, the snake cultists have um, serpent knights like mounted knights on with green armor, and they wreck shit. So I'm kind of hoping that I don't run into any of them again. Um, ten weeks four. This should be should be interesting. And um, this is this is not terribly good. We've started in the middle of a river. So my first my first thing is to get um, on to dry land, so that. Partially, partially so that everyone can actually maneuver, because not being able to maneuver will get us killed. So they should stand closer together. Well, yeah, that's close enough. Okay then, charge. Yes. Come on, you would. Bollocks! Run away! Run! Shite. This is... Oh well. I... I'm hoping that our archers can... That. I'm hoping that I can um, well she's in it he's dead but anyway I'm hoping that I can um uh, kite these guys long enough for my um long enough for my um people to um actually do things okay so there's only the lady left. Snake goat priestess. That was painful. Fuck it. Charge. I look a mess. I'm not gonna. Oh shit! That is nasty. That's a nasty. Pole arm she's got there. P pole arm? Uh, actually, no, it's a bardish. That, yeah, those are those are pretty nasty. But we did it. So yeah, my little band didn't suffer any casualties. So that's good. What do they have? Brad, take both of those. Um, hmm. Apart from that, nothing really. Although, I suppose, I suppose I could just take everything to sell. Now, I do. Now I do. Now I do. Now I do seem to remember that when I lost. Now I do seem to remember uh, that that I did I did get quite a lot of money from um, agreeing to do a host hostage trade with for a lord, and then and then essentially run, run essentially running off with mon with money with the money. However, that may not that may not work here. So we'll see what happens. Oh, nine dinars for like three pairs of boots. That's wonderful. Um, I should really be equipping that arming sword, but 
anyway, who cares? And also the tunic. Oh, okay then. That's a nice little bit of money from that excursion. Um, so yeah, um, so yeah, um, hideout kill, hideout killing time. No, I can't hire you because you're a companion and cost thousands probably. Uh, oh yeah, I do, I do kind of need to wait before I can, before I can tangle with them again. So, I'm going to wait to, I'm going to wait another day, and then I'm going to head out to Chalais and Glenmar again, see if I can get some more peasants. The little, the little, the the little sound effects they have are just are are quite are quite are quite weirdly done. They they seem they just they they seem they seem quite they seem quite loud as if as if the sound engineer didn't really know what he was doing in relation to the rest of the game. And and why and why and why. Well, the rest of the mod. I know. Oh, six empire, six empire crews. Thank you. Um, and like, and likewise, um, and like, and like, and likewise, the um, and don't, and don't even get me start, started on the terrible, 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 terrible um voice cuts. I incident, 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 incidentally, I've um. Incidentally, I've essentially gone and um, muted the volume, the voice volume, so we won't, so we won't hear that because it was real, because it was really, really annoying me. Every time I played this, my my immersion would be broken by like, well, well, my immersion would be broken by. The, the kind of terrible voice acting. Balls. Balls. That was close. That was even closer. All oh, right, of course, not everyone. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot that not everyone could um. Not everyone could really come in to this. Not everyone could actually join the battle. Okay, so gonna advance my troops. It look. It look, It looks like I've only got two archers, which is slightly concerning. Oh well, that's undead. These uh, these uh, these uh, these empire labor labor recruits are not too are not terribly bad. You know, I do I do like pole arms, but I tend not, but I tend not to like but I tend not to be able to use them because um. Because, well, um, you know, um, it's not pole arms, pull arm, with pull, with pole arms, you really need to keep your distance, um, so that's the leader dealt with, that's good, considering, one, considering I'm on like 5 HP. Come on, get around the house. 
and he's dead. So, all right. I I always I always quite I always quite like the slightly bloody look that my that character does have after a battle. Anyway, steal all the bread on all the cheese. Ooh, I'll take that. Uh I'll take pretty much everything here. Um Scythe. Hmm. Um. Well, I'm kind. I'm kind. I'm kind of conflicted here because most of the combat is close quarters because you can't because and and it's and it's a century and most of it's close quarters because you can't really. Because you can't really stop the enemy getting close to you. I mean, um, but I think I'll stick with the lance. Ooh, I could get a pitchfork. Pitchfork. <laughs> anyway, um, just take everything. Ah, right, my own, my own inventory is full. Okay. Well, nothing else really worth getting there. And some soldiers are ready to upgrade. So that's wonderful. Um, back to Janos, tell the merchant. And sell my ship. Uh, actually, I should maybe have sold that, but it it doesn't sell for much, so who cares? Yes, merchant person, I have, I have rescued you. I have rescued your daughter, and I got two hundred dinars. So that was that was not terribly bad. Um. Although I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to rest here, but I'm not sure I should pay five dinars per, per night. Ah, screw it. So anyway, um, at the moment everything appears to be relatively normal on the map um yeah every, oh actually i don't know if i don't know if the ravenstone i don't know if the ravenstone starts with falcon dark castle i'm not sure they do anyway never mind um so that should be me rested up I'll go to the castle here, see if the Lord is in, and it doesn't, no, oh, doesn't look like it, so that's pointless. Uh, now some soldiers were ready to upgrade, so I shall, I shall upgrade them all. All one of them. Okay, that's the thing. Um, and now it's time for me to go on a, me to go on an adventure. I think. Who are these people? No, Super Patrol. Okay, 
I always, I'm always, I'm, I'm, I'm always quite, I'm always quite worried that these people, that these people do, um, uh, that these random bands of, that these random bands of um, um, NPCs are bandits because there are a lot of bandits, and there are a lot of types of evil people who can kill you. Anyway, this should be fairly easy. I know get some pr I know get some prisoners I know get some prison I know free some prisoners out of it that I can hire. Darp. <laughs> Running time Fuck Fuck <laughs> Oh fuck it. I'll just retreat to my God damn it. Hello, stab, stab, stab. So where's this last guy? Oh, okay then. Um, I'm quite worried because he seems to be wearing armor. Oh, it was a cell sword. Never mind. Nothing to see here. So. As far as far as far as I remember, the farmers upgrade into uh, mercenaries. Well, um, really expensive mercenaries, and the peasant women upgrade into something usable. Well, in terms of in terms of where I am at the game where I am at the moment in the game anyway. So ooh, that's no it'll make it'll make a nice thing to sell anyway. Just steal everything. Steal everything. Um soldiers have have become upgradable so that's wonderful. I'm gonna go on to either ethos and see what is there. Um, oh, I've got an upgrade point. Well, that's excellent. Um, hmm. I think I'll get a point of power draw because that will allow me to more effectively use my crossbow. So I've so I've actually so I've actually done a dumb thing. I've actually upgraded my one handed weapons and then realized that I'm relying upon my two handed weapons more. And I'm not sure whether to keep using my two handed weapons or just scavenge like a sword from someone. So that I can use a sword and sword and shield. Anyway, um, yep, militia, because militia are not ter not terribly good, but better than recruits. So yes, um, I 
That's just a patrol. Okay. Crisis, cr crisis averted. That's excellent. Hmm. Maybe try. I'll maybe I'll maybe try and pick up some more mercenaries later. Uh. Well, later as in like now. What do you cost? Seven for four hundred and twenty-four. Uh, no. What? Oh. Oh, you're a companion, of course. Let's see what you cost. I'll give, I'll give the, I'll give the, um, I'll give the, I'll give the, I'll give the designers credit. Credit. It is, it is a well, it is a well, well, well thought out background story. You know, just all the lore. All the lore is pretty well done. Um, how much do you? How much do you? Um, how much do you cost? Wow, that's a bit. Um, that's a bit out of my price range at the moment. Mm. Uh, I should re I should really have, I should re I should really have taken some prisoners. I feel because because prisoners are really because prisoners are really good um, sources of money, despite the fact that I technically be a complete bastard for selling prisoners to slave traders. Hmm. Hang on. Do do I actually have any skills in prison management? Okay, two. So that should enable me to at least capture some prisoners if they're not all killed in a battle. So right now, time to go and find people to murder. Um, or I could, I could possibly. Um, wait, hang on, you. I could, I could put, I could possibly explore foreign ones to try and find someone who will, who will give me, who will give me some money that I can run away with. Yeah, I'm not the most of ethical of players. I've more predilection for peace than war. But that does not mean I will tolerate any incursions into my territory. Okay, I I thought I. I'm con I'm confused. I thought I um I thought I. Uh. I thought I thought I um I thought I. Uh, Oh, okay. So, oh, okay. So the voice clips come under sound, not so much. Um, they don't have their own slider. Well, that's wonderful. So I'm stuck with a fucking annoying voice acting. Excellent. Uh, not, not, ter not terribly much in the way of outgoing wages, but still. A substantial amount. I know. Let's um. These treaties are always nice. Let's go and oh, snake out party. So that's. Let's let's see if I can get these. Oh, okay. The Lord isn't chasing them. Well, that's annoying. 
Um, so so far, so so far, this is going a lot better than I expected. But think, but things could easily change, like very easily change. Uh, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to Sorrowly on territory and see what kind of things are in there. Why are they chasing me? What? Why? Oh god. Oh god! What the fucker? Oh. Well. That's put me to that point. Oh. Jesus Christ. There's. There's an old troll. And the Noldor. The Noldor are completely amazing. In terms of actual fighters. Well, that didn't last long. And it's time for me to run. Like, majorly. Well, the reinforcements are coming out. Let's see what... Let's see what happens here. Right, let's go for it. Yay! Battle. Now I'm I'm obviously going to be um I'm ge I'm generally going to be advancing my forces behind the main the main armies because I only have eighteen men and the enemy and 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 the armies by comparison have a lot more. Men are not better troops on old cheese. Those are those are my those are mounted knights. That's terrifying. So I just dealt zero damage to a horse. Oh Jesus! Holy shit! Run! Run away! Run away! Now. Oh jeez! Ah! I'm punching them. That worked. So, um... So, um... So, so, uh, so essentially... Oh, my... People are getting cut down. Well, at least that means I don't have to pay them. Right, fuck it. Charge. Because charge. So this is this is going I'll be, I'll be honest. It's not going as well as I thought. Don't stop, move, there's people right behind me. And that, and you see, and you see, and you see now that we're getting through the infantry, we're chopping them apart. However, here come another cavalry wave. So we're all gonna die again. Get off the horse. This. On second thoughts, this may not have been a, an excellent idea. Well, this this was not an excellent idea. This was not an excellent idea. This was not an excellent idea. I'm always paranoid in case someone. <laughs> I'm always paranoid in case someone actually 
someone in case I get horse charged from behind because if I do I'm dead I have I have so little health that that at the moment it's hardly worth it so anyway well, let's see how many people I have left I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that that I'm pretty sure that that peasant woman was mine. Well, I'm almost dead. This is interesting. Well, well, I'm dead. So, so we are, so we are, so we are killing them, but we're caught. We're suffering an awful lot of casualties. I mean, we suffered. I mean, we did. I mean, we did. I mean, we did suffer quite a lot of uh, casualties on our side on that in that first engagement. So they're so they're pre so they're pretty much um on more. So they're pretty much holding their own. And look, yeah, more knights and what look like. Sorry, we on long bowman, which are deadly, so I'll be running away. Um, where are these people? Oh, back there. Why are you back there? So you can all go here. How many people do I actually have left? I wonder. Not a lot. Not a lot. <laughs> well, at least that means I don't really have to pay them. So this is this is going not terribly bad, to be honest, in terms of what's actually happening. Although I really should not be on this horse. I quite, I kind of question whether I should be, whether I should shouldn't be further back. Sort of. <laughs> and yes, we are dying. We are dying horribly. Oh, shit. Well, I'm dead. Yep. Yeah. I'm unconscious. Alright, well. I'll just wait for this to play out. Hmm. We seem to have um. We see. We see. We see. We see. We seem to have killed all the mount troops, which is excellent. You know. Although the Sorrowly on Longbowman are still proving, even the Sorrowly on Longbowman are proving a problem. So, yeah. We appear to be dying horribly here. So, yeah. Oh, okay, so I'm too damaged. Well, that was terrifying. Oh, I can capture you. So, providing, so, pro, so providing that Sorleon makes a ransom demand, that, that should, that should end up being pretty 
that should end up being pretty good in terms of money uh, anyway I'll talk to you no tax collecting um okay fair enough I do I suppose I support I support I support I support I support I suppose the ethical thing in being a tax collector doesn't appeal to me that much but you know money <laughs> Someone's besieging Liara. Now they're not. Okay. Now they are. They're outraged. I don't care if they're outraged, you fools. Oh, an old or army. Well, goodbye, life. <laughs> Especially if they come into the Empire territory, because an old or army will just roll, will just kill everything, literally. And we are no longer under siege. Wait, Ravenstone's being sieged. Okay. Is it? Where am I? Okay, I'm here. Huh. Apparent apparently it is. Oh, no it's not. That's a, that's a lot of taxes. That's a great deal of taxes. Am I supposed to be, like, stopping this? It did say seven days, so I'll wait a couple of days. Oh, well, forces are moving out. Someone's someone's dying. Seven thousand dollars. That's um. I'll be I'll be I'll be I'll be honest. It's mighty tempting to just keep that. It's very tempting to just keep that. Hmm. This is this is a real kind of moral quandary I have here because on the because on the one hand I could really use that money to I could really use that money to um I could really use that money to do stuff with like set up a business but on the other hand um if I did would I would probably I would probably not last very long uh, was it you? No, it wasn't. Okay. Um, where is your brother, I presume? Oh. Huh. Okay, so the okay, so the Empire are losing the war with the Dishar. That's a bit concerning. Uh right, location of someone. You Liara. Okay, fair enough. Um Where is Liara? She's there. Okay, we've been peace. That's that's excellent. 
so I no longer have to worry about being destroyed by Sorry on patrol. That's wonderful. So I shall find this person and then I shall end this episode there because I should I should have Okay, random, random snatches of music. Uh, anyway, who crosses my lands without my permission? Stop talking. Anyway, um, I should, I should have enough money to um, to um, do something with anyway. Okay, so um, one thousand three hundred. Dinars. That's that's fair enough. Oh, that's right. No. Well, anyway, anyway, that's that's pretty much all. That's pretty much all that I feel like doing um today. These these are these are these early stages will be a bit of a grind, um. Unfortunately, there's there's a bit there's a bit of an issue here with. I mean, Pindor. I mean, Pe I mean, I mean, if you just if you're just starting out in Pindor, it does take you a while to build up to build up, um. Like um a party and a decent income, and it takes even longer to build up a decent source of income, more to the point, um such as businesses and the like. Um, but anyway, we shall I shall continue this probably tomorrow. All right, so goodbye, folks.